Okay, I'm really excited about hearing this for the very first time. So it's Dirty Loops and Corey Wong. They did that song, Follow the Light, which was, I mean, my, my favorite song so far this year was that. This is Thriller. Now, the song is called Thriller, so I'm assuming it's a cover of Michael Jackson's Thriller. That could be fun. Let's we'll see what they do with that. If that's the case, it's seven minutes, 27 seconds long. Uh, without further ado, and go! <clears throat> Okay. Cool effect on that bass. It's yeah, it is pretty much. Nice. But it's got a swing to it. Custom sound was added there. Did he trigger that? The hi hat work on that. The brass section is so tight. for this what's happening oh that ride symbol's on its own pattern or loop that's hard it's beautiful like a movie score. The drums are doing some different anti-pattern stuff. It's cool. That's so hard coordination-wise to have those accents. He's got sunglasses.
Okay, and we got like two and a half minutes of credits. Which I'm sure are very interesting, but I'm not going to watch them on this. Uh, that was a bit of a surprise. So I, I obviously, knowing the song was called Thriller, I had a suspicion. It, maybe this is going to be a cover of Michael Jackson, and it was. But I wasn't expecting it to be a reimagining of it, r like, rhythmically, in terms of... It's, the, the whole thing was swung. The drums did some madness during that kind of subdued section where the brass were doing this whole movie score soundscape style of thing. Um, the ride symbol was on its own pattern and the rest of the drums matched what the brass needed to hear to stay in with the main rhythm. That's so hard to do, to have those rolling over each other patterns of accents. Jesus, very talented. And also he had those drum fills like he did in, um, which one was it now? I can't what it's called. Oh, Work Shit Out, I think it was. He did this like quadruplets between floor toms and kick drum and I'm sure if he did the same thing again, there's like one foot doing the double kicks. It's a delicious sound the way he does that. Um, yeah, the drummer's ridiculous. Oh, and I enjoy a phenomenal drummer like him who can, during the beat, do exactly a simple beat, repeat it tight, just that swing throughout the verses. But then, obviously, whenever he wants, he can just some mad busy fill and then rein it straight in back to a straight beat um, or a swung beat, obviously, in this case. But just the, every musician in this band is really good at like being simple, being decorative in the right moments where it makes sense. So then you don't lose sight of where the song is going. Um, so that was great. That was a really lovely uh, interpretation of Thriller. The brass was tight as hell. The bass made some excellent, amazing, enjoyable choices with the notes they were hitting, but also sound was kind of unusual. Sort of a warbly, um, old school kind of 80s sound. It was almost like it was a keyboard sound, right? It's coming from the bass. That was cool. It was a nice choice. Um, yeah, they all did a great job. I think there was a moment there in the video where the bass has jumped and the camera tracked him. Did, did I see that right? And the rest of the band, like, that was kind of fun. All right, I enjoyed that. Dirty Loops are uh, yeah, making me very happy these days. I'm, I ended up doing like a Dirty Loops reaction once a week because I'm just, it's what my body needs right now is this kind of music. So uh, in and amongst the heaviness and the other pop stuff, I'm making sure that I'm checking in with Dirty Loops because it's bringing me joy. So thank you. Um, I'm not sure what the next one there is I'm going to check out is. I think someone said something about Breakdown, maybe? Or something about Coffee Break? Or Song for Lovers? I don't know. There's somebody to choose from. I'm going to do them all. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed that. Let me know what you think I should do next. Uh, if you want to see more things from me in future, feel free if you've not already done so. Have a wonderful day. Maybe I'll see you in another video.